Hey everybody, welcome to Art with Miss V. This week we're going to learn a fun and easy way to draw bubble or block letters. For this activity you'll need a pencil with an eraser and some kind of marker for outlining. To begin I'm going to divide my paper in two and demonstrate both styles of writing. You'll want to start by writing your letters very light and sort of far apart so that you have room for the bubble or block shapes. I'm going to write the same word at the top and the bottom to show the differences. Again, remember to write your letters very light and spread them apart slightly. Let's start with bubble letters at the top. Watch as I lightly surround the shape of my letter with a curved bubble shape. The hole in the middle of the A becomes a circle. All straight lines become rounded. Watch as I lightly go around the T with a rounded bubble shape. And now let's try the same word in block letters. For block letters, use straight lines and angles. Using straight lines and angles, lightly draw around the shape of your letter. Now it's time to outline our letters. This is a really good time to change anything you don't like about your design. Notice I'm not using a ruler when I do my block letters, but you can. Now take the eraser and go over any pencil marks remaining. This is why it's a good idea to draw light the first time. Using whatever art materials you have around the house, color in your design. Now I'm going to try writing my name. I want to make sure I use the whole page, so I'm going to make my letters really big. I'm going to draw them lightly because I'll have to erase later. Now I'm going to carefully go around my letter with a big bubble shape. Notice these shapes are sort of overlapping. That's okay. And now using a marker, I'm going to carefully outline my letters. Now it's time to erase those extra pencil marks. Don't forget to color in your design. I'm using paint, but you can use any art materials you have around the house.
Now let's try the same word in block letters. Notice my straight lines. There's no right or wrong way to do this. I added patterns to this design. Get creative. So which will you choose, bubble or block letters? I can't wait to see what you create. Bye, see you next time.